All right, Shalom. Let's start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shab Bahasham, Racha Kodash. Double honors to the elder apostles and the elders at Great Millstone or GMS. Peace and blessings unto the elect out there, okay? This is Isaiah 32. And I'm going to start at verse 9. It says, Rise up, ye women that are at ease, okay? And that's the majority of our women, man. Okay, they are at they are at ease. Okay, hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Okay, careless meaning you don't have care, not for what's right. Okay, our women's care is geared towards this system. Okay, and what it can do for them. Okay, it says give ear unto my speech. Okay, what's the speech? The speech is the words, the prophecies, okay? The things that are contained within these holy scriptures, okay? Give ear unto my speech. Many days and years shall ye be troubled, okay? And right now, women are, are, are being troubled, okay? Not like how they're going to be, okay? It says... Many days and years shall ye be troubled, ye careless women, for the vintage shall fail. Okay? This place is failing. Okay? And you get all your little goodies and perks from Esau Edom. Okay? From that serpent. Okay? That you made a pact with in the garden. Okay? But all that's going all that's coming to an end. OK. Females that I've talked to. Oh, just need to get back the way it was. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah. So you can go right back to doing what you've been doing, being careless. OK. Being reckless. OK. Not taking heed to your power. OK. Not trying to get under a righteous man. OK. And trying to do what's right. According to the heavenly father okay it says for the vintage shall fail the gathering shall not come okay pretty soon these little perks and benefits are going to be gone it's about to be every man for himself okay and all these independent women so called because None of you are independent. No one's independent. Let me say that. Everyone is dependent on someone or something. Everybody. Y'all, we're all dependent on something. Okay? No one is independent. That's a farce. That's more of that wine okay that babylon pours out to our women you can be independent you, you're not independent you're dependent on someone i don't care if you got your own business phd and all that crap you still dependent on something okay you depend on something you and our women depend on this system to work in order for them to live at ease but this system is going down okay rise up ye women that are at ease okay Let me jump back to verse 10 many days and years shall ye be troubled ye careless women for the vintage shall fail the gathering shall not come tremble ye women that are at ease be troubled, ye careless ones. Strip you and make you bare and gird sackcloth upon your loins. Okay? As you see, the men of the Lord, that's what we do. We've, we've girded ourselves with sackcloth. Okay? Because we're in a state of mourning. This is not our rest. Okay? Verse 12. They shall lament 
for the teats. If you ever seen a a a a, a dog that's had puppies, the little puppies come, they boy, they follow that old mama, you know, and they whimper and cry for her to lay down so they can suck. Same thing with this with this swine. And you little piglet women, you gonna lament for that teat when it's dry. Ain't gonna be no milk in that teat. Okay? You shall lament for the teat. In other words, the breast for the pleasant fields, for the fruitful vine. Okay? Because it ain't gonna be no more milk left in this system. Okay? And this scripture is going to happen. It's already beginning to happen. Okay? Get a quick scripture. Isaiah 55 and 11. So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. See? Listen to this speech. So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void. How does the word of the Lord go out? Through his servants, the prophets. Telling our people, look, all hell is getting ready to break loose. And right now, it's a it, our women are at ease. Totally dependent on this system. In a, in a, all the way from your, your, your welfare recipient woman. To your PhD sitting up in her penthouse. Y'all need for this system to continue as it was. Hence, you're dependent on this system. Okay? But the vintage shall fail. And you will lament. You will cry. Because all the females I've talked to, they just wanted to go back to the way we were. They just wanted to go back like how it was. Please let it go back how it was. I needed to get back how it was so I could get back at ease. Let's get us another quick scripture. Micah 2 and 10. Arise ye and depart. Arise, man. Okay. Hey, you women that are at ease, arise. Depart, meaning get your mind out of this system. Okay. And the women that are, are, are going to be chosen to will. Okay. And the rest are going to perish. Okay. Rise up, you women that are at ease. Arise ye and depart. Get your mind out of this system that's going down. It's like you're on the Titanic and, and it, the, the ass end of the Titanic is up out of the water. The front end is, in, is under the water and you're trying to find out where the bar is so you can get a drink. Arise ye and depart for this is not your rest. This ain't it. America is not your rest. Babylon the Great is not your rest. Okay? Because even with all the little perks and, you know, all the privileges it gives to our women to, to, to really keep them being disobedient, first and foremost to the Heavenly Father and His Son, and also to the men of Israel. Okay? It keeps them disobedient. Okay? This is not your rest. Why? Because it is polluted. It shall destroy you. And that's what it's doing. It's what it's always been doing. It's always destroyed us. Okay? But again, this focuses on the women. And our women are destroyed, man. Okay? Anytime you look at a, a, a profile or look at pictures of a woman... And her behind is facing towards the camera. 
Get away from that one. Okay? Our women are not modest. Okay? You can't even call them women. A woman is a help. Okay? Now women could care less. They're careless. Careless. Okay? This is not your rest. Because it is polluted, it shall destroy you, even with the sword destruction. Okay? Um, let me go back just real quick. You know, we'll finish it out. It's just something I was meditating on. All right. I'm going to bring this out one more time. Tremble, ye women that are at ease. Isaiah 32 and 11. Be troubled, ye careless ones. Strip you and make you bare and gird sackcloth upon your loins. Okay? They shall lament for the teats. Okay? And again, these teats are drying up. Okay? All these benefits and perks are about to be out the window. And in that day, you our women are gonna realize that they are they are they are females. And they can't do all of what they thought they could do, what they saw on TV and heard through this music, okay, and what Esau has told them. Okay? You're not equal to men. And you women are going to be looking for men to get under in that day, man. Okay? So the Heavenly Father is giving a fair warning, even to our women, to get your mind right. Even though we know our women are not going to be totally right, because it's going to take that fear, okay, for them to humble up. Because right now, our women are proud, man, especially against our men. Okay? They act like they stuff don't stink. Okay? And, and, and anything they do, they can't do no wrong. Okay? It's everybody else's fault. They the victim, no matter what. We see what the result is of our women following the philosophies of of Babylon the Great is, man. Total destruction. Our houses are destroyed. Okay? Because our family structure has been broken up. But who gives our women that liberty? Babylon the Great, man. Rise up, you women that are at ease. Okay? And again, this is a fair warning from the Heavenly Father. Because this day is fastly approaching. Things are never going back to the way they were. Okay? The, you women can forget it. It's done, man. Okay? And it's not going to be a smooth transition over into the kingdom of heaven. As some are teaching. All hell is getting ready to break loose, man. And you're gonna, women are going to realize that you're not as strong and independent as you claim to be. Okay? You kill his daughters. And again, the ones that are allotted to get 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 up out of here and get up under righteousness will and the rest are gonna perish. Okay? Lord willing, this was edifying, okay? Give all praise on and glory, because this place is going down, man. This place is done, okay? All praise on and glory to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shai, Bashim, Rakakodash. Double honors to the elder apostles and the elders at Great Millstone, or, or GMS, all right? Peace and blessings to the sincere Akim out there, okay? Pushing his word and truth. And, and, and faith, okay? And to the Aquats that may be listening, trying to do what's right, peace and blessings unto you also. Until then, I say shallow warm.